Alright, so recently someone asked me to do a more revamped version of the first seed grinding because it's a bit outdated, it's a bit old. So, yeah, it's a good idea. So, I'm just gonna try to show you guys a bit better on first seed grinding methods, areas, you know, all that stuff, all the good stuff that you need. Um, so, to first explain, you're gonna want. Before anything, you're gonna want dragon for the first scene. You always want dragon. Uh, for the buffs, I don't know, but try to get Ace's hat. You obtain Ace's hat by going to in first scene, the gem shop, and then the second page. It's just Ace's hat, right? I'd recommend getting that. It's pretty good. Gives you a lot of HP. And then, so yeah, I'll show you guys the best area to grind at. All right. So first off, I'll show you guys. You first want to head to Wilderness, right? You want to finish the first island, get some base stats off, and go to Wilderness. You want to go to the NPC, and I don't know how to really explain it, but you stand next to the NPC and you press on it, kind of, and then you go into your dragon form, and then you accept the quest, and then line your crosshair up where the enemies are without leaving the quest screen. Kill the NPCs that are in front of you, and then re-accept the quest, so you never have to leave the screen. Just makes it a lot easier and faster. So you want to do that at Wilderness, then you want to do that exact same thing at... Wait, where is it? Uh, Luffy's Island. You want to go to Luffy's Island. right? And once you do Luffy Island, and you get pretty far, far up, you want to go to Ice Island. So let me find the Ice Island on here. Ice Island, you want to go to the Ice Island, right here, right here. Once you're at the Ice Island, you want to do the exact same thing, but since the new Ice Island is a bit different and changed around, it looks... It's different, so you're going to have to try to figure out how to do that grinding method. Just don't follow my original video on how to do that Ice method, because it's the island is, you know, new. And you're going gonna, to you're gonna keep doing that. You're going to want to keep doing that until you can get into the second C, but once you're second C level, you want to go to the multiverse C, then you want to head over to um, Goku's Island and then grind gems. I'm going to grind gems there, right, so you have a pretty good gem setup, and then you want to get a good, um, you want to get the Gojo and Toji style, oh no, sorry, sorry, Sukuna and Toji style. Both of these styles, you want to get that from the multiverse C, and if you have all those things, you'll have a pretty good jump start in the, uh, in the second and third C. Most players don't even have Toji and Sukuna once they're in. Um, or brother, in first C. I mean, sorry, second C. Once they enter second C, which you probably won't be able to do Toji because the boss has like 10 billion HP. But you can, you can try to get some friends. Make it easier for you. So yeah, that's that's about all. Uh, if you're wondering, what I have on right now is the new best, new best stuff everything that's the best pretty much but yeah guys that's about it for for this video it's a bit short video just a quick explanation so yeah thanks for watching guys bye